We're looking for clients who make the world a better place. Is this an organization that is high functioning? Do they value marketing as a critical driver of their business? And are they making the world a better place for the work that they're doing? And if the answers to those questions are yes, we'd love to work with them. Selling a degree is a hard thing to do, right? So going to college, even for a year, often costs more than what it costs to buy a car. Putting up a billboard or running a radio commercial and not doing it well, it's just not gonna work, right? We're trying to sell 18-year-olds on undergrad and they're incredibly fickle. So you have to figure out how to come up with a way to distill that brand promise and that message and that differentiator into sometimes just a couple of words that nobody else could own in your marketplace and that your incoming students will be proud to be affiliated with. When somebody needs to go to an emergency room or they need to consult with a surgeon, outside of does my insurance get accepted there, people don't know what's the difference. Every hospital has an emergency room. Some of them have trauma centers. We've worked with hospitals to help them figure out what is their story? What makes your hospital different than the hospital a mile and a half down the street? And how do you help the marketplace understand that difference? I've never met a marketing director marketing VP or CMO who wouldn't tell me that they feel completely overwhelmed with everything that's on their plate and who doesn't use phrases like, I wish I could clone myself. They sort of can clone themselves. That's what I built this business to do, is on the fly you can pick up the phone and say, hey Kate, we have a big project. Is there any way that you could help us run that? We have a love for working with not-for-profit organizations, social service agencies like domestic violence agencies and other local charities are some of our favorite clients. Unfortunately, some of them don't have great budgets, but we find that sometimes just helping them tell their story a little bit differently makes a huge difference to their ability to meet their mission. So we've developed some really fun programs, and the one that is probably most popular with our clients is what we call the Grammar Game Show. We hang up a clothesline, and there are cards all along that clothesline, and they say things like, is it S apostrophe or apostrophe S? And what happens is the employees jump up out of their seats and they grab a card, and I stand at a flip chart with a marker, and we tick off 30 lessons in 60 minutes or less, and I tell you, they line up because they have more questions. If you're an organization and you haven't invested in your employees to teach them how to be better communicators, you need to ask yourself why. And you have to understand that employees who can't communicate cannot close the deal. It is my hope that after a client works with us, that what they look back on with their relationship with Silvertree is that they say, we are sharper, we are smarter, we're asking better questions, we're challenging our own status quo, and we're doing that because Silvertree taught us it was okay.